Roguelad Sully here with a quick yabo from Frosty Piper. Stay tuned. <laughs> There we go. Roguelad Sola here, doing a smoky yabo uh, here on Sunday afternoon, right before the Super Bowl, getting ready to go to a Super Bowl party this evening with some buddies, and thought that I would uh, chime in real quick with uh, a yabo, which was uh, part of a gall that I won. It was actually a gall that I won from Frosty Piper. Um, right now I'm smoking a Peterson P Lip 106 Limerick. This is one of my restoration jobs. Um, and in it, I've got Cornell and Deal uh, Redburn, which is a Burley, Virginia with some dark fired Kentucky. Um, I recently saw uh, Eddie on the Pipe Nook do a review. <clears throat> I want to say it was his uh, top 10 tobaccos for 2018, and this was one of them that was on it. And Eddie, thanks for the recommendation. Um, it's a really good tobacco. I'm trying to get in a little bit more to the Burleys. Um, and it seems that Cornell and Deal has quite a few of them that are pretty good, and this is one of them. So appreciate the, uh, the review, Eddie, and, uh, and the recommendation on this tobacco. It's real good. Um, the Yabo that I'm going to be doing is from Frosty Piper. He recently reached 200 subscribers. And I believe, actually, he's sitting at about 275, almost 280 now. So um, he's climbing pretty quick, and that's a testament to the content that he puts out on his channel. It's really good. Um, so I'll do this quick yabo, and then I'm gonna get off to uh, watching, hopefully, the Rams win the Super Bowl. Sorry if that's not popular up in the Northeast, um, but I think most of the country's ready for somebody else to win. Um, so with that, I'm gonna do this quick yabo, and I gotta say, um, what Frosty was giving away in his uh, Yabo was pretty impressive. Um, he frequents, uh, according to his channel, he frequents his broken motor, mortar uh, quite a bit, and he is able to pick up uh, Esoterica tobaccos, which I've had some success on a limited basis doing the same. Um, seems to be that's where I find most of the opportunity to get um, some of those special releases. I've gotten some small batch from Cornell and Deal. And some esoteric is there, um, full Virginia flake. So I tend to find things that I can't find online that are gone like that um, in my brick and mortar. So he does the same and he has picked up quite a few and he offered them up for his 200 sub uh, giveaway. And I was lucky enough to win and uh, can't express my appreciation enough. Um, I have tried several of the uh, Esoterica tobaccos and they are phenomenal. There's something about them, I don't know what it is, something the way they treat their tobacco or something that they all have kind of that unique taste. So with that, I'll show you what he sent me. So first up, he sent me a tin of Margate. I've not had this one. So I'm looking forward to giving it a shot. Um, he also sent me some and soda bed. Hopefully you can see that. And soda bed. That's two. That's three. Some Dunbar, which is a vapor. And soda bed is uh, English, and Margate is an English. He sent me some. Dorchester, which is also a vapor. And he sent me some Tilbury, which is a Virginia. Uh, extra, extra mature Virginia. So I have yet to try that one. Looking forward to giving this one a shot as well. Um, and because, and of course he also sent me a bro note, um, because Frosty is so generous, I mean, you couldn't argue that fact by the fact that he was giving away five tins of Esoterica. And he was even more generous than that. So he threw in some Pembroke as well. Can you believe that guy? And not only that, he threw in some Esoterica, that's probably hard to read, Blackpool. 
which is a Virginia. I've already uh, chooched on this a little bit, and I gotta say, I'm not usually a fan of, um, we'll say topped Virginias, but this one's got a little bit of a licorice flavor to it, and it is phenomenal. Um, it kind of gets sweeter and sweeter as the bowl goes on. So that's all the tobacco that he sent me. Um, Frosty Piper, I cannot say thank you enough. Um, I really appreciate the opportunity. Uh, congratulations on all of your success and, and obviously continued success since you're up at 100, uh, 200 and almost 80 uh, subscribers now. And um, I appreciate it, man. Uh, I love this community. I think it's, uh, it's great. Uh, there are so many people in this community that love to give and love to share. And uh, I do that too. I tend to do it behind the scenes a little bit, but um, that's just my personality. But I recently hit 200 subscribers myself. Um, in fact, yesterday I hit 200 subscribers. So I'm, uh, the wheels are turning. I haven't quite figured out what I wanna do yet. Um, but uh, I think I will be doing something here in the near future. So uh, keep your ears open and your eyes peeled for something in the near future from my channel. Um, as soon as I kind of get everything together and figure out what I wanna do, I will probably be doing a gall. Um, as you know, there's a ton of them in the YTPC right now. Um, and almost everyone starts out with, you know, I was trying to wait until they kind of slowed down, but um, this community is so good, I don't think they're ever gonna slow down. So there's probably no good time to do it. I just need to kind of get everything in order and figure out what I wanna do. So with that, I'm gonna go watch the Super Bowl at a buddy's house, um, go Rams again, and uh, that's all I got on this Saturday afternoon, actually a Sunday afternoon. So with that, I am Roblide Soli. Keep the rubber side down. Mm -hmm.